Number six right here is called scar tissue. So scar tissue is vastly overblown because it's not really scar tissue. What it is, it's a tight calf muscle, tight hamstring, tight knee, and tight foot that leads to ankle joint equinus. That means if your Achilles tendon is tight right here, your foot can't bend up as much. So say your left foot, which is the uninjured foot, can bend all the way up like this, whereas your right foot, which is the injured one, can only make it to about here. That's gonna make you twist your foot out to make up for it. That's gonna make the outside of your ankle hurt with every step. That's called ankle joint equinus. So take a look at this guy. He lands perfectly vertical with his heel bone and his foot because he has flexibility. He's a younger gentleman with flexibility. He hasn't really suffered any injuries. But you can take a look at this person. They're tighter through their calf muscles. So see how the bottom of their heel is twisting out and their feet are twisting out with each landing. This is what's going to cause ankle joint equinus or subtalar joint pain.